Hey superstars, I'm Sue and welcome to my channel Reviews with Sue. If you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much for coming back and supporting our channel. If you're new here, welcome. I'm Sue and if you're considering that subscribe button. So would you like to know what today's unboxing is all about? Well, I have my Navy West to share with y'all today. So if you want to know what's inside this package, then just keep on watching. Doing reviews just like I do. Hanging out with your friend Sue. It's Sue. And I'm back. I'm with Nadine West to share with you all today. If you've never heard of Nadine West before, it's one of the most affordable styling services out there. When you first sign up, you're going to fill out a profile. Your likes, your dislikes, and all of your sizes. Now, their sizes actually range anywhere from extra small all the way up to 3XL. Based on your preferences, your personal stylist will select some items for you. Now, the cost of this subscription is $17.99. However, if you decide to keep any of the items, they're going to credit you back that $17.99. If you decide you want to ship everything back, then unfortunately you will forego that $17.99. Now, I am an affiliate of Nadine West, which means they actually send me these items over free for review. So they did give me an affiliate link, which I'm going to leave down below in the description box. I'm pretty sure it still works. And if you do use it, I may receive a little bit of kickback from that. And if you ever use any of my links, please let me know in the comments down below so that way I can thank you personally. I do want to thank Nadine West for sending this over. Now I have to say, I didn't even know this was coming. They actually put the influencers like, like on a pause, I guess you could call it, because they were revamping their website. So it looks beautiful, it looks nice, and you guys definitely need to check it out. I'm excited to see what's inside this bag. And guess what? That's probably why you're here. You just want to see what they actually styled for me. And maybe this is something once you see the items, you might want to try this for yourself. So let me show you my bag of goodies right here. Well, you ain't seeing much. You're just seeing some little words on a pink bag here. And I have to say, I do love the pink bag though. But my address is on the other side where the Nadine West is. So unfortunately, I couldn't show you that side. So let me go ahead and get into this. I have not gotten into it yet. Now this is perforated so you can open it up. And then usually there's going to be some burritos in here. So let's see what I got here. So, ooh, look at that. That is totally me. I'm excited. I am so, so excited. And then, oh, we got our little card here. I have a, another little burrito in here, I believe. It's a coming. It's a coming. It's a plumper. Oh, it's, it's, it's a boy it is. I know, I'm so silly. Hey, did you guys notice? I'm actually filming in a different area. I'm filming in my bedroom because guess what? The sun is in my sunroom. Go figure. Now, another thing that they do is they do give you a bag so that way you can ship your items back of the items you don't want to keep. And again, too, when you sign up, you can actually get this every two weeks. You can get it monthly. You can pause. You can cancel. You can skip at any time. So it's very easy to, you know, get this, give it a couple tries. If you want to pause, you can. So anyways, there's a bag if you do decide you want to send anything back. And then we also have here, the shipping label is right here that you're going to actually attach to the bag if you do decide to send anything back. And I'm receiving, oh, looky, looky. Oh, no jewelry pieces this time around. You, Every time I've received this so far, they've always sent me a piece of jewelry, but it looks like I'm getting all clothing items. And it looks like I'm getting one, two, three, four, five, six items. So let's see here. Oh my gosh, all these colors are looking so awesome to me. All right, we're gonna start off with this bundle right here. And you can see it does say Nadine West there and my bundle just, <laughs> it just burst. So let me go ahead and open this up here and see what we have. Now it looks like to me, these are going to be bottoms maybe. We're gonna start with something that kind of looks familiar to me like a bottom. So let's see here. So our first item I have looks like a pair of yoga pants. So this is the pants right here. They're calling this the Norella Skinny Black. Brand is S&G Apparel. Guess what? That's my initials. It seriously is. Sue Goulette. And this is going for $23.99. Wow. So it definitely has some stretch, which I do love me some leggings. And this is what they look like. They have these cute gold zipper pockets. Let's see the waistband. Yes, nice and stretchy. I like that. And then these are going to be skinny ones. So you can see it's going to go tampered right there at the leg, which I love because I can wear them, like dress them up with a pair of like maybe little chunky heels or I could like dress it down and just wear it with a pair of like little Roxy's. And let's see here. It does have these zippers. I'm really curious to know, does the zipper work? So when I unzip the zipper and I put, oh, wait a minute here. 
Looky, looky, hello. This zipper is like a faux pocket. Oh man, I was really excited about that pocket. So let me see, oh, but wait, wait, it's gonna get better because look, there is a slip pocket right there. So you might be able to stick your phone in there. I can get that much of my hand in there. But these are really cute. They're soft, they're stretchy. Hopefully they're long enough for my long legs. So there is the first item. And then make sure you stay tuned to the end of the video because that's what I'm gonna be doing my little try on for you. And then we have next is going to be this item here. And this is the Holly Dark Blue. And the brand is J-V-I-N-I. -I, and these are $14.99. Holy moly, what a great deal. All right, let's see what these look like. And they are gonna be skinny jeans. Let's see here. Do they have a little stretch? Yes, they have the stretch. Now, sometimes people look at these and they think of maternity pants because guess what? It has elastic. But I have to say, these are the most comfortable kind of pants out there, especially if you don't do any tucking in I because I usually keep my shirts out. But let's see here. So it has like a fake, like not a zipper there, but it's kind of fake looking. And we have a pocket over here, which is a functional pocket on both sides. And then it definitely has some distressing on there, as you can see, which I do like because it kind of roughens them up a little bit. Hello there. And then they are long and they are gonna be skinny jeans. So that looks pretty nice. And then the back side looks like this. It has working pockets and their pockets, it seems like they're always kind of like a little bit smaller than your standard ones. Now this is gonna be in size large. So apparently I changed my size back to large. I go from large to extra large, large to extra large, because I'm like right in between. I just can't figure out exactly where I'm at. And then, oh, lost my card. Excuse me, I'm back. All right, so my little card here is showing the last one. And this is the last one. These feel very lightweight. These are the Yoli Pants. The brand is GT Imports. This is in blue. And these are $19. Okay, so let's see what, let's see what this $19 item is. I like the colors in this. And these are going to be cute. Oh, goodness gracious. Look at how cute those are. So they do have those two little buttons right there. Now looking at it, it looks like it's a little bit on the sheer side does have a waist here in the back that does have like definitely has some stretch to it. Now these to me would be kind of like lounging pants almost. They're going to be long like this and then the bottoms of them are going to be nice and flowy as you can see. So there is the third item. Let me show you the back. This is what the back looks like here and let me see here. We've got a pocket we do but like I said they're a little bit on the like you can kind of like almost see through them. So there's that. So those are the bottoms. And then I have these cool looking tops over here. I know I'm not quite looking at the camera right today. So let's see here. Maybe I'm kind of feeling weird because like I have like a different scenery that's on the other side of the room. So we have our little burrito. It says Nadine West. So let me get into this one. Let's see what's in, oh man, I love animal prints. So I is excited. So let me see if I can try to figure out what is what with these animal prints here. So the first one is saying that this is gonna be ivory. This is a Shayland top and the brand is J. Michelle of California, $14.99. So let me see what this looks like. Oh, this is cute. Okay, I might be able to get into this, but the only thing is though, is I'm trying to figure out where, what's the front and what's the back here. Let's see here. I mean, it's very pretty. It has like, a, I think this is the front here. So it does have like this crocheting here in the front. So you're definitely gonna have to wear something underneath it. And it's very lightweight. It's kind of like a gauzy material. Now the back of it looks like this. So it's gonna be kind of like open in the back. I don't know if I can pull this off or not. And then you can see in the back there too, it has like this like zigzag that goes through the back. And I'm pretty sure trying to see where the tag is on this thing, but I'm pretty sure this is the backside. I might have to look up a picture of this to see exactly how it's actually being worn, but it's definitely see-through. It's cute. Uh, I don't know if it's my style. And I lost my card again. It just keeps dropping onto the floor. Let me stick it here to the side. So we have next is going to be the Lyra woven chiffon top with lace trim in leopard. And this is by San... Susie, it almost sounds, looks like it's S-O-U-C-I, and this is $19.99. So I'm trying to think which one is this, because there's two. It must be this one here. So let's see what this one looks like here. 
I like the print. Oh my. Okay. This to me would be more of like a fall top. To be honest, it looks more like my sister than it looks like me. But it does have like a little tie there in the front. So if you want to leave it hang, you can or you can tie it. The sleeves on this are going to be kind of like a puffy sleeve. And then around this area, it's not elastic. Uh, okay. Well, I'll try it on, but I'm just not sure if this is me. But I do like the print of it. And it's very sheer, so I'm going to definitely have to wear probably like a black tank top underneath it. Here's the other side. I'm not sure if you're getting a full view of it or not, but this is what it looks like right here. And right, look, you can see the light shining right through it right now, right? And then you have the back side of it over here. And now let's move on to our last item, which is going to be the Furlan Open Neck Printed Top in Large by Jones New York Pink, 1999. And that's this one here. So if you look at it real close, you can see there's pinks in there. And then I believe there's some navies, some white, and maybe a little bit of cream. Yeah, that's definitely navy. And let's see what this looks like. This is something I think I might like. Let's see here. Ooh, okay. It's actually kind of on the casual side. I thought it'd be a little bit dressier, but this is what the front of it looks like. So it just has, it goes down to a V, which I love my V-necks. It is short sleeve and it just has like a little baby cap sleeve on it over here. Here is the whole shirt way back there. The bottom of it, it does have a little bit of a curve. I don't think it has a high low on it though. And then this is the back side of it right here. So this would probably look really cute with those little jeans. And then the black would go good with the black leggings, I'm thinking. Now these two together are not like a set whatsoever. So I might just throw them on just to kind of like show them to you. But what I'm going to do now is guess what? I am going to go out of here and I'm going to come back and I'm probably going to be somewhat in the same area somewhat or another. And we are going to do the try on. So I will be right back. So I'm back and thank you for sticking around and not clicking me out. So I have the first outfit on and I have to say it's very cute. However, the top here, which I love this pattern, it's a little bit too big on me and it's just kind of like flopping in the wind. I'm thinking that maybe I could do like a side knot over here and it would kind of like pull it all together, but I'm not really sure, but I do love the style of it. You can see it has a V-neck right here and the sleeves on it are nice and loose. I think it's cute. It's just a little bit too flary and a little bit too wide here. The back of it looks like this right here. I don't know if you're getting a good look at it or not. And then I have the jeans on and they fit great. Now the top is a large and go figure. I was getting extra larges, right? And they were too big on me. So I downsized to the large and now this large is too big on me. We're gonna have to try those other two larges out to see if maybe do I need to go to a medium on the top? But if it's a fitted shirt, then I need a bigger size. So it's really hard to play the game, you know? And for the bottoms here, I think these are super cute. Let me just kind of tuck that in there. So it does have some real pockets right here. It does have the distressing, which I love. The color of them isn't a color I normally gravitate to, but I think they're really cute. And they are stretchy because they have that elastic band around the waist. There's no zippers and no button, none of that good stuff. And then on the back, this is what they look like. You got the functional pockets there. The length on these are good on me. I would, could dress this up, I could dress it down, I could put a little heel with it, or I could just put my little white Roxy's on and, you know, go off to a soccer game if I wanted to. So here is the first outfit. Let me know what you guys think down below in the comment section, and I'll be right back with the next outfit. So now I'm back with the next outfit. And this one, I don't know. The top, I love leopard print. I love animal print, anything. But this seems a little bit too big on me. Go figure. So this is a size large. You can see the sleeves are long, which I do like the sleeves long, so that part really doesn't bother me. But here, you can see how much extra material is in here. It's completely see-through, so I do have a black tank top underneath it. The front of it here, you can see it has this nice little lace collar here. It does have two little animal print ties where you can just kind of let them dangle, or you could always, you know, kind of put like a little knot in here if you wanted to. Let's see, can I get a knot in here? Maybe, maybe not. <laughs> Maybe I need somebody to help me. <laughs> just kidding. But there it is. So you could just like put a little knot there. For the back of the shirt, 
This is what it looks like back here. I kind of forgot what it looks like, so maybe you can tell me what it looks like. But that is the back of it. I like the length on it, but I have to say, it's just too loose on me. I just, I don't get it. Did I lose that much weight? I've never actually weighed myself lately, so I had lost about 10 pounds or so, but maybe it's not back. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. I thought I gained all my weight back after my last vacation. Now, for the pants. The pants fit me great. They're very comfortable. This is what they look like. I just tucked in my tank top. So over here, there is a little pocket there. It does kind of like pop out just a little bit though. And then it has these zippers, but they're actually faux zippers like I already showed you. And then here is the back side. Now I can't remember, are the pockets? Nope, no pockets. The length on them is great. They go all the way to the floor, just like I like it. And this is a second outfit. So feel free to let me know what you think of this one on me. Is it a yay or is it a nay? So I'll be right back. So I decided to keep my pants on. Yes, I kept my pants on. You're very welcome. But I did put this top on. I just thought since I already had the black on, I had a black tank top on, I give this one a try. This one is so-so to me. I'm, I'm just not sure how it looks on me. The collar on it's fine because sometimes if a collar is too close to my neck, it really bothers me. But this one has a little bit of a scoop. But the detailing in this is beautiful, I have to say. It's a very light linen-y kind of a material. And I have to say, it's probably never going to look unwrinkled because it's just going to look that way. Now, let me show you the back. The back of it's very cute, very detailed back there. It has a little crisscross action going on with a little string going through it, which I probably should have fed through a little bit more. But overall, it is cute, but it's not exactly my style. And feel free to let me know your honest opinions I'm, you know, are always welcome here. No feelings will be hurt by me if you say, Sue, that looks like, you know, what on me. It's okay. I completely understand. But I do like to get your guys' opinion just so I know if I should actually go out like in the real world with this top on or not. But again... The bottoms, I'm still loving them. They're very comfortable. I can do can-cans if I want to. I can do jumping jacks if I wanted to. I could do cartwheels in the, if I wanted to. So they are very, very comfortable. Plus they actually look a little dressy with these like little zippers here on the side. But I have to say the odds are the zippers are gonna be covered up. Nobody's gonna see them. They're just gonna see the bottom half. So guess what? I think I got one pair of pants left. So I'll be right back. Yes, I'm being lazy and I didn't wanna take the top off or the tank top. So I just left it on. I was gonna throw a white t-shirt on and I thought, why should I go hunting in my closet for a white t-shirt when I could just leave this on? So now I have the pants on. So this is the new item. They're very, very comfortable. They're very flowy. I have to say this would probably be more like for me, like a lounge pants that I would wear just like laying around the house because they are kind of on the see-through side. So if you see through it when I turn around, then guess what? You got a free show you did. So these actually have little pockets there on the side. There's a pocket there. There is a pocket over here. It has these little detailed buttons right here. So it does add a little bit of pizzazz to it. But again, my shirts are always gonna be over them just like this. They're super comfortable. I could probably get away with putting a sandal on with them in a little t-shirt or something and wear them out to the beach and take a walk and maybe roll them up a couple of times and they would be really fun and just kind of nice and flary. But the odds are, I personally would probably just wear them around the house. So let me go ahead and pull this top on or up here so you can actually see it there. So you can see there is the pocket there. Cute. There. Let me walk up so you can kind of see the back side of it. And if they're see-through and you can see my panty lines, then yes, you did get a free show you did. So this was the final item. Now out of all these pieces, so there were six pieces. The pink top I really liked, but it was a little bit too big on me. But if I do a little side knot, it might work out. The jeans fit me great. The black leggings fit me good. These pants fit me good. The, I guess it's like the tops that just didn't work out this time. This top, I just don't know if it's me or not. The um, animal print one is probably not me either. And then the pink one I did like, and so that one's kind of like an iffy. So overall, 50% of the items I do like. Actually, um, four out of six of the pieces I like. Let me know what your thoughts are in the comments down below because curious minds want to know what you guys think and that's me of course. I do want to thank Nadine West again so much for collaborating with me in this video. Remember I do have my affiliate link that'll be down below in the description box just in case you want to check it out for yourself. They did a little revamping and from what I understand their communication is a lot lot better now. So if you haven't subscribed to the channel please consider hitting that subscribe. 
a like on your way, it would be great. And if you have an extra time, hop on over to Instagram. Follow me over there. It's Reviews of Sue, just like my channel name. Other than that, that's all I have for you guys today. So please be safe, be well, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.